tonight, Bradley University students in Peoria honoring the two victims that investigators say an intoxicated driver killed. The person police say was behind that wheel is still reportedly attending classes at Bradley, and now students are reacting. Our Sheridan Hertig joins us live in studio to tell us how this is stirring up a campus controversy. Sheridan. Thanks, Mark. Students held a candlelight vigil for the two people hit and killed, and I spoke with a few students on campus who say they want to remember the lives lost. Stephanie Malgozo was arrested on April 10th for hitting and killing two people. Students have posted on the application Yik Yak that Bradley University is allowing Malgoza to walk at graduation. A social media, there was a post made and it included the list of who was going to walk and Stephanie's name was included. And I honestly like got really upset in the moment. Garcia organized the vigil in protest and says she wants to use her platform to remember the people killed in the accident, but also hold Malgoza accountable. We got the visual because we wanted to pay respect to the two lives um, loss of Paul and Andrea. And we also wanted to make an emphasis that we don't think she deserves to walk on campus. Some students saying everybody should be able to decide if Malgoza attends graduation. Everybody needs to have a say in this and going forward, I think that they need to show that graduation is a privilege. Being able to walk at graduation is a privilege and unfortunately I do not think that Stephanie earned that privilege. After Garcia wrote a message on the sidewalk for students and faculty to see. Bradley decided to wash it out with water. They decided that not to address the issue at all. Melgoza was arrested on two counts of aggravated DUI resulting in death, two counts of aggravated reckless driving, possession of cannabis, and illegal transportation of alcohol. She bonded out on April 12th for $15,000. A lot of the time, especially from being a private college, that we forget that we, have an, we are part of this community. Whether we like it or not, we're part of this community. We have an impact. We reached out to Bradley University administration who refused to comment or allow us on campus for tonight's event. Mark.